Hello, GameSpot viewers. It's senior editor Kevin Van Ord, and I am pleased to be here with executive producer of Disney Infinity, John Vignocchi. What's going on, Kevin? Uh, not much, except the fact that I'm looking at Syndrome running around. Now, a you, toy box version of Metroville. This is this is pretty great. And, and now, granted, you're not here just to show us all the things that we can already do, but to show us new things. No, I think you covered uh, a lot of the stuff that we can do inside of Infinity uh, during your review. Oh, gosh. Um, is, so is this the I'm, part where you give me a hard this time? This is the part where I say oh. I'm surprised I'm here talking to you because you gave us a six. But I'm thrilled that you guys went and did a second look from a parent's perspective and yeah. granted it as an eight. Well, it's interesting too because because my my you know my my perspective on the game aside, I'm rather addicted to getting all of the things, and I think <laughs> I think that speaks to the power of having these physical entities that I place on top of the board, and now I I feel a connection. I feel like hey, this is this is Mr. Incredible, and he lives with me in my home. Yeah, I mean, and <laughs> I'll tell you what. What's interesting about Infinity that that we've seen since it's been released is that. Um, you know, regardless of the reviews, guys like yourself like spend more and more time with it and begin to like it more and more and more as time goes on. Um, once they fully get to understand everything that you can really do you know, inside of the platform. Right, and of course now you're here, and and but before, I want to make sure we we get a, a rundown of everything that's that's coming out that's new because you brought some. You can't. The, the, unfortunately, the viewers can't see this, but I can see right in front of me some wonderful figures that I don't yet own. That's right. And I hopefully will soon <laughs> own because I'm a grown adult and I can spend my money how I want. Thank you very much. <laughs> That's right. But uh, so I'm looking at a few figures. Am I allowed to say what these figures are? Absolutely, please. All right. um, what you're actually looking at right now. So this is our biggest um, character release since launch, and so in your hands there you have none other than. Uh, the the master of disaster himself, Mr. Wreck It Ralph. Wreck It Ralph, and so uh, I think I, you should open that up I'm and gonna, put I'm that down. Open it. I want to put it this close to my ear so people can hear me opening oh, the package. That, look, it Syndrome's so freaking out. Don't bring Ralph so in here, man. Feels so good. All right, so this is I got Wreck It Ralph here. I better get a I, I better get a gun or something. I love the film Wreck It Ralph, so I'm glad that uh, oh card. I, can't lose the card. Don't lose the um, card. Just elsewhere. released that a PC a version. Place. Just released the PC version last week. That card works really well on the PC version. Did you really? Yeah. Wow. I didn't even realize there was a PC version yeah, of Disney actually, Infinity that came yeah, out. Yeah, it just launched uh, wow. last week, and uh, it's available for download. And uh, yeah, it's it's great, especially the keyboard and mouse controls for building and flying and stuff. It's, oh, it's now, awesome. see, now you're convincing me. But back, um, that maybe but I need we have that. to go back to the, the holiday characters, otherwise uh, I'm going to get in trouble with PR here. Okay, okay. So let's. But uh, I'm ready. I'm ready with a blunderbuss so for Wreck you. So I've got Wreck-It Ralph. Do you want me to put Wreck-It Ralph yeah. on the on the on the platform? But we make some sort of noise or something. Some fanfare okay. here. Like. Yeah, yeah. Wreck-It Ralph. No, okay. press start. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> now that's choose not your profile. <laughs> yeah. I suppose I uh, I suppose I should have had you uh, uh, do that before. Go ahead. I'm trying. I think that's you this Oops, time. Oops, that is me that time. Nice. All right. That was really dramatic. Here I am. Here I am. Na, na, yes. Na, na, na. Hur hurry up and wait. All right. Wreck It Ralph has joined. Boom. In your face, Ralph. <laughs> You're gonna wreck it. I am gonna wreck it. Okay. Let's let's check out what Ralph can do here. Okay. So um, you know you have uh, obviously standard some of your standard attacks. Ralph's Excuse got a me, ground pound. Ralph can also fly <laughs> in a helicopter. It's been too long since so, oh, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm great at helicoptering. Look at how great I am at helicoptering. Well, that's because I'm shooting I'm you. I'm just going to get out. <laughs> Come so, back. Anyway, just for everyone that's watching, that's uh, Kevin there on the uh, on the right-hand side of your screen and me flying the chopper, who I'm going to take him out as he's slowly exploring around. Um, important to note, though, we're playing two players, same screen multiplayer right now, but Infinity is four players online play uh, inside of the toy box mode of the game. All right, now, so explain in more detail this place that you've created. So this right here, if you guys will take a look at my side of the screen, this is one of the toy boxes that you can unlock in the game um, by playing through the Incredibles playset. This is the Metroville toy box. So essentially this is a toy box that's been created using all the different pieces specifically from the Incredibles playset with the exception of Cinderella's Castle, which is right there. I made myself. So it's really um, up to you. Once you put this down, you can edit it however you want to. But this is just one of the, the pre-built toy boxes that uh, you get by playing through the Incredibles. 
but of course you can also create new toy boxes. Yeah. Um, now, now tell me now that you we've got say Wreck It Ralph here. What other, you know, you, we've got the figures. What are some of the things that he can do that I can't, for example, do with with other characters? So I've got this attack that I've seen already. Yeah, which is, exactly. which is pretty clever. Yeah. So if you remember that uh, that really funny scene in the film, actually, do you mind if I open up your uh, just so everyone listening? I've given Kevin all of these holiday figures. Oh so, my lord. Um, you this actually really don't sad. have to. You can spend the money you'd otherwise spend on Infinity buying presents for family. Or you have a cat too, don't you? I, yes, you know way too much about me. <laughs> well, this I did really a little bit of research scary. when I saw you give our game a six out of ten. So don't worry. Who is this guy? <laughs> Who is this guy? Um, the heck is going on? What's your cat's name? What kind of cat? My do you have? cat's name is Ollie. Uh, um, should I? So should I open Vanellope? But I what already is... knew that. I'm just oh kidding. Oh my god. <laughs> so should I open? Right, yeah, open a Vanellope. Vanellope. Okay, yeah. here we go. Can you hear that? There we go. That's me opening Vanellope. Oh. It's got that new toy smell. I love that. It, that's almost oh, as good as the uh, as the new video game smell, right? When you almost. open up a video game, it's like, oh. So I'm going to take Syndrome off now, and we'll put down the glitch herself, Miss Vanellope Von Schweetz. Spoilers! Also from uh, Wreck-It Ralph. <laughs> Um, so, actually, Sarah Silverman does do uh, Vanellope's voice for the game, which is a riot because she did a ton of ad-libbing. And so you'll hear her kind of constantly taunting all the other characters as they appear, all the other Disney characters as they appear inside the toilet. I love that I forgot how to play. Okay, so, um, <laughs> don't worry, the helicopter controls are really easy. I hope the guys at Avalanche are watching because I always give them trouble about this. But basically, uh, right analog stick moves you up and down in the air. Uh, right trigger is, uh, is your gas for forwards and backwards, left trigger backwards. I love that I can't remember how to, how to play the game that I was addicted to just a month ago. <laughs> this is, this is what happens when you, it's the life of a game reviewer. Woe is me <laughs> that, that I play so much for work that I forget how to play games. So Vanellope's got, uh, she's got a whole bunch of stuff that, um, that, first of all, you know, inside of the toy box, if you recall, there's all those chests that um, you can unlock with the different characters. And so with Vanellope, she actually goes to uh, unlock the um, King Candy's Royal Racer as well as Vanellope's candy cart. So I'm going to go ahead and put her candy cart down here on the ground. Um, so you can see just kind of what that's about. Please. Um, Vanellope also has her glitch ability, which is really fun. If I go ahead and spawn uh, an enemy here, um, you can actually see how that uh, that's affected by her. They, they glitch out just like they do inside of the film, which is really cool. Um, so the... Uh, So um, she has that, which then causes glitch damage to the characters. She also has cherry bombs, which is really fun. You can also shoot missiles at them. So Kevin, why don't you, or yeah, are you, oh, you want me to get back in the? No, okay. whatever you want, man. Or we can throw our cherry bombs too, which is kind of fun. Hey, oops, sorry, bud. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I think you shot a missile at my go kart, though. You did it again. <laughs> <laughs> so hold on, Welcome. where'd it go? Where'd <laughs> Pain in the ass. Oops. Welcome to the Edit joy that. of Disney Infinity. So this is <laughs> this is the ultimate griefing game. I want to make sure that that's clear. The kind of thing you do in Disney Infinity is you make people's lives miserable. Well, so the that's whole, one of the things that you do. <laughs> the whole point is inside of the toy box in one of the game. You know, this is obviously there's just for a refresher for people that might be watching it the first time. There's play sets in the toy box. Play sets are like true to property experiences where you're playing through. Uh, an actual story that has objectives and missions. In the toy box mode, you can build and edit your world however you want to, but then also at the same time, what we're trying to do here is give kind of the element of what it's like to play, like if we were actually playing at our house, you know, in, in, in our living room or in our playroom or wherever with our toys. So you can kind of play however you want to. And so if you want to give, you know, different things like um, Halloween Town jack-o'-lanterns from Nightmare Before Christmas to Vanellope, you can do that. Or you can use um, her standard attacks. Um, there's also these cherry bombs that um, Wreck-It comes with and Vanellope comes with. And so this cherry bomb here, since it's Wreck-It's one, is actually an 8-bit um, version uh, versus Vanellope's one, which is more 16-bit. So lots of different things you can do here and just kind of experimenting and playing. You can just get lost. That's the point. And that's also why it's so much fun to play multiplayer with friends. It's absolutely adorable. Now, how much... How much are you, are, are these characters, are you also going to be giving us uh, goodies added to the play sets? Yeah, so um, let me, and, and let me, toy boxes yeah, and let me show you. So one thing that's cool with Infinity is that every one of these characters comes with their own custom adventure. 
And so um, every time you get a new character inside of the toy box, you can go on these adventures with each of the characters. So, for example, now that Vanellope's down, she has this uh, adventure called Vanellope's Sweet Ride. And up to four players can play this online multiplayer if we want to, or we can do it locally two-player. I guess we're going to do it locally, huh? We are going to do I it see, locally. I see we've begun. We have begun. So I think if you jump out of there, that menu should pop up. I'll just fall. Yeah, there you go. View invites. No damage. And then this particular, and then go ahead and accept. So this particular adventure is actually based um, loosely on uh, on Sugar Rush. And so we went through, and uh, and for this character, we designed this totally custom course that you can race with Vanellope or Wreckit or you know Mickey or Rapunzel or any of the characters that you have. But you have to have Vanellope in order to uh, initiate it. Speaking of Rapunzel, that's one of the newer... Uh additions is it not yeah absolutely yeah. so let's when we started it was funny because everyone was like it's all pixar Ugh. and it's like okay guys you know we're not idiots obviously we're gonna put princesses in here and it's a platform for all things disney so we're gonna be adding a ton of stuff and content over the time uh, or over time so that's why you see rapunzel there and then also we've got uh anna and elsa from our new film frozen um that uh, are going to be available this holiday too so let's race by the way I right. keep talking, but I'm just going to go ahead Whoa! And so, yeah. And you're right there inside of um, Wreck-It Ralph's truck. Your your vehicle goes remarkably faster than mine. Actually, I am behind you right now. Oh, are you? Yeah. Okay, the one was in front of me. All right. See, here's always the thing, though. It's like I, I always feel like I can be good at games until people are watching. It's like it's it's performance anxiety. Well, you know, imagine for us whenever we have to do these demos, I have to talk and play, which is oh, always so always difficult. Hard, right? I mean, everyone knows what I'm talking about. It's like when your mom turns you and is like, "Hey, Johnny, have you unloaded the dishwasher?" And you kind of are just like you don't say anything. You're so but instead, I just have slowly begun to learn how to ramble and and talk and play video games. And I don't know, but I uh, I'm shooting things. Lightning McQueen. I'm in first place right now. But... Yeah, boy. Oh, wait here. That's cool. This is what you uh -huh. get. This is what you get for Bye. six out of ten, boy. Oh, it's now, coming. Come on. <laughs> come on now. <laughs> now it's my turn. All of that anger. All oh! of that extra time oh! that I spent away from my family, Kevin. Does he? <laughs> Man, I'm tweeting about this later. I was, I was physically Don't worry. threatened it was by just, John Vignocchi. It was just three years of my life. <laughs> oh no! Um, <laughs> this is not. This is not how I wanted to go. This is for all the guys at Avalanche that busted oh, their no. butt as well. No, I'm just kidding. Aww. Oh, nice. You get me back. That's fine. Um, anyway, so you get to I'm see in what last this place. Oh, I went from last to first in just a minute. Okay, Woo! this is all good. Grinding on the side there, so you can see. Anyway, this this course is totally designed, um, you know, using all the sugar rush stuff and, and um, you know, themed to Wreck It Ralph. Now, Wreck It has one as well. Do you want to go and try that adventure with? Wreck -It? Oh yeah, totally. Let's yeah. do that. Oh, so, I'm out of the course completely. I'm <laughs> gonna go ahead. We're gonna leave adventure. So pretty. Yeah. <laughs> and so, so the, uh, anyway, so all these adventures, any of the characters can participate in, it's up to four players, so that's a ton of fun. Um, and then, um, you know, one thing that we haven't talked about, and I don't think you had actually mentioned in your review, but for what it's worth, the user-generated content stuff. Oh, yeah. Um, so we've been, like, running contests now every single week for um, user-generated content. Um, so we've basically been doing these theme contests where we're like, hey, this week, re recreate the, your favorite scene from a Disney film, or hey, this week, why don't you go ahead and uh, make cool pixel art, and we've got all these contests that we're doing, you know, coolest sports game that you can make, whatever. And so we're getting like thousands of submissions each week from the community, and then we highlight what the best ones are, and then allow people to download. So we've actually been doing this since launch, and I'm happy to announce that as of yesterday, we have had over 2 million toy boxes downloaded. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, it's so it's like it's just really eye-opening. The community right now for Infinity is super exciting and we're having a really really great time, you know, like working with those guys, seeing exactly what everybody wants and what new characters they want and what new contests they want. So, it's um it's been a lot of fun um, you know, to to have a game that has such a, a strong robust community. But go ahead and hit pause and jump into uh, go to travel and, and then uh, if you select adventures, perfect. And then Wreck-It's Wrangle.
All right, let's do this. Now what? Now what? What are we doing here now? So we're gonna um, we're gonna load in real quick to this adventure. Now this is a two D platformer adventure with Ralph. Um, and uh, again, if we want to, actually, we can put in some of the other characters to show off. Um, Wait, why don't I have? I don't have Phineas in my yet. collection. Oh gosh! No! <laughs> Teases! Tease! 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 That's tease. all this is all the time. <laughs> it's like, oh, oh, look, there's there's Phineas. Oh, but you can't have him yet. <laughs> All right, everybody, so it's Kevin and I racing in the Ralph adventure here. Oh, this isn't going to go well. Uh, no, it's fine. We can and we can also, you know, be collaborative if we want to. But basically, we um, go ahead and attack these blocks, and then when we do... Ow! And then when we do that, uh -huh. um, you uh, you should go and collect these little pieces here. Oh, well, you can do And that. then it's a race to the top. Um, and then to collect all these. Looks like you're having some trouble there with your perspective. Oh, who's that? Penelope. What'd it do? Oh, <laughs> really? You know what? Really? Re <laughs> I know what you're trying. Oh, hey. I know what you're trying to do. I was Come trying on, to throw Ralph. you off. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready for you. Bring it on, boy. Uh huh. Oh, oh. <laughs> See, this is okay. Okay. Now here I, it comes. I don't believe in cooperation. This little, is very important. A little bit of wipe out here. Oh ah! no! I'm glitching. Forget you. You know what? Can I pick you up? Yeah, I can. Oh my oh. god. <laughs> you got caught on the platform. Oh, oh! Bobble, you know what? I wish... I, oh my gosh! Look what you've done to me! I wish I could have... Ah, there it is oh. again! <laughs> look what you've done! Alright, I'll come back. I'll come back. That's not cool. It's not, it's not that cool for me to grief you this bad. Oh, no, of course it is. That's what this game is. You seriously mismarket this game. <laughs> this is this is not a game for you and your kids. This is a game for if you want to break up with your significant other. <laughs> Oops. Oh. Gonna have to use that platform. Oh. No, all right, all oh, right. Hey. Right. <laughs> hey. I can't resist. Oh, Gosh, you came it. back. Um. Anyway, so <laughs> you get a little of this adventure. If it isn't my favorite candy princess. Oh. Okay. Oh, 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 hey, you were waiting for me. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, 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 fine, fine. We're gonna we'll do we'll do this the right way. <laughs> oh. Oh. You know what? I was willing to call a truce. I know, I know. Oh! I just jumped in the lava. You know what? You deserve to win. No, I don't. Normally uh, when we're doing demos to executives, we let no! them win. No! I'm in the, the lava. But since you're a journalist. Oh. Since I'm a journalist, <laughs> nobody ever says that. I'll give you I'll give you an easy time since you're a journalist. No, I didn't mean it like that. That's I meant not like, the way it's supposed no. to be. <laughs> Boom! I have to ask the hard-hitting questions like, uh, you know, when's all the Tron stuff coming? Oh, that's a that's a great one. Um, I would love for the Tron stuff to come. Uh, I'll give you my my standard answer that's oh. been approved by PR. Infinity is a platform for all things Disney, which includes Tron, and it'd be really cool if Tron joined sometime. We're not ready to talk about future characters for the platform just yet, but look for announcements soon. Oh, and oh I yeah, there is Tron Elements <laughs> that you tease I got, us I got, with. I got corrected by PR in the middle of it. Uh, yeah, so we do have some Tron Elements in here. So we've got Power Disc for, um, for the Tron that actually do a sky and a ground piece. For, so you can theme your entire toy box to um, Tron Legacy. We also have a uh, Recognizer inside of the game, and we've got a Light Runner. Um, and we also... It's actually, ah, it's actually funny, we also have a, uh, a uh, Tron Disc. Um, that initially didn't make it in the uh, in the uh, release version, but we actually just patched in. Uh, there was a bug with it, so anyway, we just patched it in, so that's in there now. So we've got a lot of Tron elements inside the game. You also had that uh, that Tron. Uh, whoa, whoa! No, that's not what I wanted to do. That what did was you a do mistake. To, you did something. Okay. I broke a thing. No, no, no! You didn't break anything. You. No, I didn't break the game. I I, I smashed the the glassy icy bit. Um, I don't know what's going on. Oh! I caught that. When you defeat an enemy, they'll gather yeah, collectibles. Collect as many as you can before you're out. Ooh, of ooh! I'm really glad I did that. I mean, you got you got eight of three. I got fifteen. 
Yeah, you're, oh, you're doing much better. I'm, I'm, I'm now totally distracted. But then you tease us with the little Tron thing, the, the Tron toy box. There was a, yeah, like yeah. that combo toy box. And then I was like, oh, but I want to do things here. Sorry. Which, yeah. oh, because, yeah, actually, you so you can't edit this one. No, you're able to edit them, any of those downloadable toy boxes, so long That's... as you have um, unlocked all the toys that that toy box is made okay, out of. Okay, so it doesn't need the pieces necessarily, but like the Tron parts? Uh, yeah, exactly. So if you have, um, if you've unlocked, like, you know, let's say a toy box is made out of Toy Story and Space Elements. As long as you've unlocked those elements inside the Toy Story in Space playset, then when you go into edit that toy, or then when you go into that toy box, you can edit that toy box. But it just the game's just looking for the fact that you've uh, beat that section of the game in order to give you access. Okay. Um, but you want to go back into the toy box real quick and take a look at uh, some of the new princesses. Yeah, totally. I know you're Aww. a big Disney fan. Big, Di I love my Disney princesses. Who is your favorite Disney princess? Oh my lord. Um, Belle. Oh, why Belle? I mean, Be that's that's an okay why choice. Are you, are you <laughs> questioning my masculinity? I, no, I was... <laughs> nope, not at all. I was just uh, wondering why Belle. Um, I don't know. She likes to read and she she's probably my favorite, maybe my favorite singer in the, uh, you know, in the in those movies. How does so. that how does that song go in the beginning? Little town. My favorite part of that is when Kevin she Kevin sings when she a demo I know of Disney Infinity. But, when, but it's when she sings Look, isn't this amazing? <laughs> she's singing she's singing you have like a decent to a voice. Ghost. You have a decent voice. Right? I she's heard it like, like the, to the vibrato there or whatever, man. That's not a good. Now Speaking of singing princesses, let's talk about Anna and Elsa. All right. So, so this is these girls are from these. Uh, sorry, <clears throat> excuse me. These princesses are princesses. from Frozen. Okay, I've got the box here. Should I open it? Yeah. All right. All right. Hold on, everyone. We're Some taking our figures food. off. Oh. Me too. See now, I don't know these girls. These these wonderful princesses. Because they're brand new. Yes. So um, these two new wonderful princesses are from um, Walt Disney Studio Feature Animation's new film, Frozen, um, which is a, a telling of the Snow Queen story. Um, and it's about Anna and Elsa, who are two sisters. And um, one of them, Elsa, who I'll let you be, okay. is, um, it has the ability to freeze things when she touches them. So obviously a very fun, gameable character. And then Anna is her uh, uh, is her little sister, and um, it's a, it's actually the the film itself um, has music made by um, some of the same people that worked on uh, Book of Mormon, and uh, oh. <laughs> yeah, so it's like it's is it thematically similar. No, <laughs> oh man, <laughs> but it's an absolute treat. It is a ton of fun, and uh, it's a great movie to see with the family uh, this season. So um, now Anna and Elsa are going to be released soon. They also come in a uh, a version that you can get to have the power disc. So they have uh, ground and sky, so you can transform your entire toy box to be. Um, theme very much to their film. Ooh, nice. It's nice. I think I can really be myself here. So you can see now, like, you know. Everything's the, just now filling in. Everything's filling in. So all the trees swap out and now become the frozen trees. And the ground, Ooh, you know, the chilly. roads become ice. Uh, it changes the sky dome as well. So it's kind of fun if you want to make kind of a winter themed, like, toy box for the holidays. Uh, you can do that with Anna and Elsa and the power discs that come with them. All right. So which one? Anna and which one's Elsa? So I am uh, uh, Anna, uh, and then you are Anna Elsa. Elsa. Okay. And so I, I gotta say, I like Elsa better. I think that uh, she fits more. I think she fits better in this nice snowy world. <laughs> so well, they're both they're both you know got mittens on and, uh, <laughs> and yeah. But check out my uh, my frosty hair. Hey, but do this actually before you jump in the helicopter and try to shoot me again. Um, if you hit Y, you can start using some of her powers, some of her freeze powers. Oh yeah. And so I she wanna... she is actually a lot of fun. She can freeze characters, um, freeze enemies. I'll spawn some enemies in. Well, that's you. what I was gonna say. Let's spawn some enemies in. Yeah. <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> All right, so give me a second. But yeah, and then you can just, if you want to, play around a little bit with um, with some of her abilities that she has. I'm trying to figure out where you are. Oh. 
Right in the middle of that. Yeah, I'm somewhere. I'm somewhere here. I'm in the in the square. Okay. There's a there's a, oh. Stay around. That? Yeah, stay around the Mr. Incredible. Okay, 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 I gotcha. I gotcha. Oh, there you are. You know what's fun is if you just completely remove ground from beneath me. I can do that too. No, don't do it. Not really. <laughs> when I say fun, I mean mean. <laughs> So, um, Elsa has those freeze powers, which is actually a lot of fun, because collaboratively, they, if you don't freeze me, collaboratively, you can freeze enemies, and then I can use Anna's shovel attack, which is a lot of fun. And then Anna also has um, a, uh, a grappling hook that she comes with as well. <laughs> it would be a better way to move about the environment. But again, yeah, with Infinity, you know, it's all about playing with these toys kind of however you want to. So if that is, you know, taking an accessory from another character like Buzz's jetpack and giving it to Anna, you can do that. So um, do you want to try Elsa's adventure? Uh, sure, why not? Why yeah, not? so just go ahead and hit the pause menu and then go to travel and then let's fire up uh, that adventure. Elsa's Snowy Slingshot, this one is called. Oh and, lord. Uh, this will be a fun... Um, actually, when you came in, in the beginning, I was playing that uh, that uh, Slingshot Adventure with Syndrome. Oh, right. Um, so we'll show you this one now. So, playsets. Are there any new playsets coming that you can talk about? So we just released the Toy Story and Space playset, um, oh. which, is, uh, which came out here uh, at the end of October. And, um, and that's all I can talk Use about right now in terms of uh, new playsets. Yellow well, now you have me wanting to go to the Red Disney store. <laughs> yeah. I, if you, seriously, if you live in San Francisco or the Bay Area, that's where you want to go for your stuff. You were saying that they had yeah, it all they, there, oh, wait, huh? They, they have a whole huge display. You want to go ahead and jump in one of these slingshots. And then uh, the point here that we're trying to do actually is, um, is just these targets here. Several levels of you pull, yeah, ba back with the left analog stick. Oh, that's what I'm doing wrong. There you go. Because I'm dumb. The, I was using the triggers thinking, nothing's happening. <laughs> oh, I got that one before you. Yeah, that's that's because you were aiming better than me, too. Oh, check that out. You actually have to be conscious of the physics. Yeah. And not pull back too far. You're just going to overshoot. Ah! Bronze. Oop, almost. Okay, ready? Keep going. Now, see, just it, <clears throat> the adventure will continue. Now it's uh, first. Of all. Well, it'll be you. Oh, oh. come on! <laughs> I'm telling you. Now you got the hang of it, though. If see, you now need to, it's a. If you need to break up with your significant other, this <laughs> is the game. Put Little Big Planet down, <laughs> which is the other great. I hate you, game. It's a great way to... Disney Infinity is a great way to settle fights. Who's going to clean the cat box, Kevin? Um... Well, we'll see. Whoever wins this contest. <laughs> so... Oh, uh, yeah. Darn it. I was real... And it would be really great to say, you know what? I had John Vignocchi come over to clean my cat box. <laughs> it was a... <laughs> You know, it's uh, what's funny is I'm actually going to be in town here next week for Thanksgiving. So, um, if you were actually to beat me, that would that would probably I would I would I would hold true to that. I live in the Tenderloin. You're okay with that? Um, <laughs> I don't know what that is, but I, uh, okay. I, I love okay. Tenderloin. It's a beaut It's a beautiful <laughs> section of San Francisco that is full of culture and wonder. That sounds great. Yes. It also, it also it's sounds a like it's you're a being a bit facetious. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Um, yes, like, at least I stole that one. Yeah, you. you did get from me. I'm gonna get this one. See, now this one's moving. A little bit more challenging. Thanks, guys. All right, what am I... Oh, 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 In the 35. Oh, wait, I want the red one. You know, everybody right now is going... No, nobody's saying that. I want to see vines of JV cleaning your cat box. <laughs> What they're saying is, what do you mean you gave Disney Infinity a six? <laughs> That's okay, I forgive you for it. I'm, oh, I'm, I'm getting all my licks in here now, live on this. Uh, on this, on this uh, I'm going to send you a list here. after we're done of all the people that gave it a lower score. <laughs> I don't want to see that. Go, I can already go, go and go see that on my own. people, John. <laughs> don't worry, they're on the rest of the stops here in San <laughs> no! Francisco. <laughs> and for the death blow. Oh, you pay in the butt! Ah. Uh, 
Yeah. Boom! He's been, been wanting to say that for a while. <laughs> we just hit the. It's uh, not every day, you know. It's funny because I came here and I thought I was gonna see uh, Giancarlo. Giancarlo, yeah. But then you showed up with a big smile on your face about. Uh, Hi, John. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Kevin. Though seriously, thanks for uh, thanks for having me no, here and getting to this check these great. out. And and I'm really glad to see. And you know, I guess this means more money to spend. Yes, but thankfully we fucked you up, so you don't have to worry about uh, about going broke this holiday. I'm still going to, you know it's going to happen. I'm going to go broke. I still have more power discs to there buy. There is. That's right. There's wave two of power discs. There's like the electric mayhem bus in there. We've got stuff from Frank oh. and Weenie, Nightmare Before Christmas, of course, Frozen. So yeah, there's a whole new 20 power disc coming out wave two uh, shortly. So you can, uh, you, can, you can get into that. It's not appropriate to say the things that are going in my head though right now where I'm like, gosh darn you, John, forcing me to spend more money because now I want to. And again, yes, I'm a grown man that buys Disney things don't judge me too much <laughs> but I mean this grown man over here helps make Disney things so <laughs> but that's right and what a, what an honor and a privilege it is to work for the Walt Disney Company absolutely <laughs> and John but John thank you so much for stopping by yeah, when thanks, can we Kev. when can people expect to see all these goodies what it, give me a little bit of a time scale of course right, right in right in time for Black Friday yes so um uh, we've got uh, some of the Wave 2 characters are out, like Woody, Jesse, Buzz, Jack Skellington, but Wreck-It and Vanellope, Rapunzel, and Anna and Elsa are all coming uh, just at the end of this month. Uh, some of them might actually be out now. I've seen some retailers actually selling them early. So um, definitely uh -oh. check your local retailer. Uh, Gosh darn it, retailers. <laughs> yeah. I guess it's a Get good thing, though. Together. It's a good thing when they're uh, selling your product early, right? <laughs> That's close. true. That's true. But uh, thanks so much for stopping by, and uh, I, I mean, I guess they can follow me on Twitter, I'm FiddleCub, and they can follow my my usual obsession when I go to the Disney store and weep softly to myself <laughs> afterwards for being a grown man that buys these things. Um, ah. But uh, yeah, I, I hear, hear you, I'm telling you, this is the ultimate griefing game. <laughs> who needs who, who needs other things when I have another player here? But anyway, thank you so much, yeah, thank and you, to Ken. all the GameSpot folks out there. Thanks for tuning in, and I guess I will see you around. All right. See you guys. Thanks.